Hi. With this movie we will show you how to use the data detail component integrated in DMX Zone App Connect Data Traversal. The data detail component is used to display detail data about a record selected in the repeat region. Let's set up our dynamic data. Open the server connect panel and add new server action. Add a name for it and right click steps. Then add database connection. Create a new connection or load an existing one. Then right click the database connection step and add a query. Add a name for your query and set up its options. Select your table and add it to the query. Then, add the columns you need and click OK. Save your action file when you are done and open the App Connect panel. Then, add App Connect to your page. Right click App and under Data, select Server Connect. Then, click the Select Server Action button and select your server action. Click the Select button. Now, let's set up a repeat region for our data. We have a container with a dummy item inside. We'll use the Repeat Children option here in order to repeat the items inside the container. Of course, if your structure requires you to use Repeat Region instead, it works the same way. Select the parent container and click the Repeat Children button. Select an expression for the repeat. Under the Server Connect component, open data and select your query. Click the Select button. Now, let's bind dynamic data for the repeat. Click inside the repeat and click Insert Binding. We insert the product name here. Click Select. Now, as we have our product names in the repeat, let's set up the data detail component. Click on your page where you want to insert the detail region. And click the Add New Component button. Under Insert Child, open Data. And select Data Detail. Now, let's set up the data detail options. Select the component in the app structure. Click the Dynamic Data Picker button in order to select a data source. Under Server Connect, Data, select the same query you are using in the repeater. And click Select. Then, select the key column, which will be used to filter the selected record on. Under the Data Detail component, select the Identity column, returned by your data source. And click Select. Let's bind the detail data which should be displayed by the data repeat component. Click inside the detail region on your page and click insert binding. Under data detail, select the binding you want to display in the detail region. Click select. Add as many bindings here as you need. We added the product name and description bindings for our video. Now, Let's set up the action, which will set the selected record info inside the detail region. We select the element, which is being repeated. In our case this is an anchor tag. But this can be any other HTML element. Click the Dynamic Events button. And under Mouse, select Click. Then, click the Action Picker button. And under the Data Detail component, click Select. Select the key value. Select the identity binding returned in the repeater. And click Select. Then, click Select again. And we are done. Now, when we click on a record inside the repeater, its detailed data will be displayed in the detail region. Let's preview the results. When we click on a record in the products list, its detail data is being displayed in the detail region. 
That's how easy it is to use the data detail component integrated in DMX Zone app Connect Data Traversal.